created on one's house of math. Fooling around with equivalent fractions and multiplication at the same time and a bunch of other stuff. All right, and notice that he built, you know, nines and tens and so forth already is the opening exercise. Okay, so what was this one? We started off with one, or excuse me, we started off with two, right? Right. So what do we got there? Nine of 18. Nine of 18. All right, so that's easy, right? And that's the same thing as a half. Okay, we're not writing anything down. How about we do this now? Oh, but you know what I'm gonna do? Hmm. Now we're gonna do two at a time. What do I have there? Uh, two of two of nine. Two of if you can count nine there, I'll give you a million dollars. Two of three. Two of three. There you go. Now I'm <laughs> trying to make it all complicated. Look at you. All right, move right there. Now how many? Four of. Yes. <laughs> four of six. There you go. Oops, that's what we just did. Now what? Four of nine. All right. If you can count four there. <laughs> Six of nine. Six of nine. Good job. See, now we're doing both, right? At the same time. Mm-hmm. We're doing the, not, the numerator and the denominator, nine and you have 12. to multiply. What do you got? Nine of 12. If you can count nine there. Eight of 12. Eight of 12. There you go. All right, let's try and keep these in order because I'm going to be using them again. All right, now what? Is that the right one? Yes, it is. Whoops. Should be. Ten of fifteen. Very good. No what? Should we do this for an hour? Over and over again until you're just absolutely sick of it? <laughs> or should we just do like a few of these and then move on to something else? You choose. <laughs> what do you think my answer is gonna be? Twelve of eighteen. Twelve of eighteen. Alright. Then what? I'm gonna say that's a set it is. 14 out mm -hmm. of mm. 21. Very good. Like it, like it. What about that one? Give you a hint, it's 8. 16. Yeah, out of? 24. Which is still the same thing as 2 thirds, isn't it? 16, 24, it's 2 thirds, same thing. Whatever that. You're a big boy, you can do it yourself. Eighteen. Yeah. And another nine is? Twenty-seven. So eighteen out of twenty-seven. Still two-thirds, right? Right. All right. Well, let's do something else. There's some refreshment. Oh, I tell you, you know what? Let's not do something else. Let's do just one more of these, and then let's do something else, because we don't want to do this over and over again. And then guess who gets to write some of this down? Yeah, that would be it. Okay, so we got one, got another one. What are these? Twos. What? Force. Yeah, but what do we call these? Um, when they're fractions? Threes. This would be one out of how many? One out of four. One out of four. So this one out of four would be another term we use for it is a quarter, right? Quarters. Quarter. So now you got three quarters. Oh, so now look what we're going to do. We're going to practice our threes and fours all at the same time. So, three fourths, right? Right. Um, three fourths. Okay. Now what? Six out of eight. Six eighths is the same thing as three fourths. Yeah, anytime you want to grab the next one. I said you're, you're a big boy, you can handle it. Ten out of twelve. What? Nine out of twelve. Nine twelfths. Like it. Twelve sixteen. Twelve sixteens. Like that. Fifteen. Mm hmm. Twenty. Fifteen twentieths. Still three quarters. These are all three quarters. Ooh. Eighteen. Eighteen. Twenty-fourth. Twenty-fourths. Okay, just for fun, you got it correct, obviously. Eighteen twenty-fourths. How did you count it? What did you do? Did you count six, twelve, eighteen, or did you? What did you do? 
Six, 12, 18, and there's death. Okay. And then you added six more to get. Yeah. Okay. Just seeing what's going on in your head. Okay. <clears throat> 21. Mm hmm. 21. 29. Oof. Try again. Close. How are you getting one and seven is the same thing as nine? Oh, 28. Yeah. So, what do we got? 21. 21. 28. 28. There you go. <clears throat> wow. Yeah, well, it's what happens when you gulp down two glasses of tea and the ice. And you walked how far to get here? Huh? How long? You, how far do you think it is from here to your house? Maybe a mile? Two? It's more than a mile. I don't know how much. I mean, here to, here to Pook Soup is at least a mile right there. I don't know. I'm just asking. I don't know. We should measure sometime. Anyway, he walked the whole way here. Why? Because math education is important. 20. What? Oh, wait. <clears throat> <clears throat> I see three eights. Don't I? Don't I? What is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, there's three of them. Three eights. What's three times eight? I don't know. Well, then count. Can you count by threes? Yeah. All right, well, let's count by threes. If you can't count by it's three, it's just going to more counting, right? This would be fast. This is going to be the long way. All right, so three, you do it. Three, six, eight, ten. Three, six, eight. We're counting by threes, buddy. Three, six, nine. Mm hmm. Twelve. Mm hmm. Fifteen. Mm hmm. Eighteen. Mm hmm. Twenty one. Mm hmm. Twenty four. There you go. Or eight, sixteen, twenty four. Repeat after me. Eight, sixteen, twenty four. There you go. And? Another eight would be. What's four want to be? Huh? What's four want to be? Ten. He wants to be ten. What's he need? Six. There you go. So I'm going to take this many. Mm, six. How many's left on there? Two. So I've got 30 and. 32. So eight, 16, 24, 32. 24. 32. 32. Then what? Oh, what's the next one? What's two want to be? Huh? What's two want to be? Ten. So what's it need? Eight. So then if I add another eight, what would I get? To what? Eight, 16, I'm just using my imagination here. Eight, 16, 24, 32, what's the next one? 30. What's two eight. need? Huh? What's two need? Eight. And we're gonna give it an eight. So what are we gonna get? 48. How'd I get to 48? I skipped one. What's two plus eight? 10. What's 32 plus eight? 40. There you go. Then the next one would be 48. 48? Yeah. Then what? It says keep adding eights, right? Just keep adding eights. Um. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 50. Something. 52. Wait a minute. What's eight and eight? Huh? What's eight plus eight? 16. There you go. So, certainly wouldn't be 52. It'd be 50 what? Six. There you go. All right. And we'll do that on the board in a second. In fact, you know what? You're going to write it down on this one. All right. Next one. Just for fun. And then we're going to quit. Well, you see, multiplication, man. we got to work on multiplication every time. And the way we're going to work on multiplication is like, you know, second power algebra, third power algebra, fourth power algebra. We're not just going to drill tables and do dumb stuff. We're going to play and enjoy ourselves a little bit, maybe, perhaps. 27. Nines. What? 27. 27 of... 36. 36. So we can count it by nines. Here we can do it both ways. 9, 18, 27, 36. <gasps> we could count it this way. 4, 8, 4, 8, 12, 16, 20. All fours do tell you how many. 24, 28, 32, 36. Fours count for you. Oh, yeah. Where's Mui the Muka? Not here. All right, never mind. Okay. Took the day off. Took the day off. Yes, he's, he's hiding in the corner over there. All right, so. Uh, and you're a little old, old for movie anyway. All right, so uh, to get a piece of paper out and let us write these things down. Did you bring a pencil? What the heck? It was in my pocket. Yay. Oh, no, there it is. Okay. That's my pencil, but that's okay. No, this one's fine. All right, fine. Could be yours. All right, fine. My stuff never has a. All right, so now write down over here. You're gonna write three of three over four equals. And then what? It was six of six of eight. Yep. Then what? 
Nine. Of, give me an equal sign in between, and put them closer together because you're gonna run a space on the page. Nine of. Twelve. You see how we're just counting three, six, nine on the bottom, four, eight, twelve in the, or excuse me, three, six, nine on the top, and four, eight, twelve in the bottom. All right. And these are the same things we just did a second ago. There you go. Go all the way out until you get to 30 over 40. Okay. All right. Anyway, so one exercise, fast with fractions and multiplication all at once. You don't have to know your multiplication in order to do your fractions. Your fractions can teach you multiplication, can't they? All right. Cruise on Ramon's House of Math.com for more.